We're going to start with Tesla up again this morning. Confused about the recent run up this year? There's new data exclusive to CNBC that reveals the big advantage the company holds over other automakers. Our Phil LeBeau is going to explain that in Chicago. Phil? And Carl, we'll talk about that data in just a bit. But with regard to that chart, one reason why the stock might be moving a little bit higher today is because of these positive reports out of China that the Tesla plant in Shanghai has reopened and has resumed production. We say these reports because this is according to local media. We have not heard confirmation from Tesla itself. Eunice Yoon says that there are reports that workers were seen entering via a bus wearing masks to resume production. We'll certainly be keeping an eye on that. As you take a look at shares of Tesla over the last week, Carl mentioned earlier today the volume last week, 172 million shares, way, way, way above normal. Not to that exclusive data. It has to do with the battery costs for Tesla and other automakers as they're building electric vehicles. Look how much it's come down for Tesla. This is according to, according to Cairn Energy, Energy Research Advisors. They basically break down batteries, look at the battery pack, look at the battery management system, and they say that Tesla is now down to $156 per kilowatt hour. That's at least $45 to $50 above all other automakers who do not use the same type of battery pack. They do not use cylindrical battery cells for building theirs. And according to Sam Jaffe with Cairn Energy Research, this is an advantage that Tesla is using and will use for years to come. Tesla has a few years advantage. They, they've started a few years before the other automakers have committed to this. So they're, they're, they're quite ahead. That's going to last over time if they continue to innovate, which so far they have. This is important data, guys, for one reason mainly. The fact that we continually hear from people saying, well, there's nothing different about a Tesla than any other electric vehicle. That is simply not true. When you talk with, whether it's Karen Energy Research or you talk with others, they will tell you that, yes, there is a difference both in terms of structure, the software, the chemistry. That is a difference that Tesla is using right now, and it's a big reason why increasingly you, when you talk with analysts on Wall Street, they say this is an advantage that Tesla will use at least for the next couple of years until auto, other automakers become more competitive with them on the cost side. Uh, for sure. The contest uh, is far from over, uh, Phil. That's good stuff. Our Phil LeBeau in Chicago. Thank you.